What's up guys? This is Mikko Raven here and today I'm gonna show you how to make custom highways for Guitar Hero World Tour Definitive Edition. Now there already exists another tutorial on how to do this, but there were a few things Derpytron forgot to mention in his tutorial that I'm gonna that I'm gonna tell you in this tutorial, which are kind of important when it comes to playing multiplayer. So anyways, so we have Blender, so you're gonna need Blender, GH Tools uh, add-on, and Guitar Hero SDK for this. All of which are available in the link in the description. So right now I have Blender open here, and this is the default scene you'll get with Blender. The, the good old cube lighting camera. But we're gonna, but we're not going to need any of these. We're gonna delete all of them. So now we're gonna install GH Tools. If you already have it installed, you, you can skip this step. But if you if you don't have it installed, go to Preferences. Uh, go to Install. Hang on. Oh wait. Go to Preferences. Go to Add-ons and install and of course in the link in the description you'll find the link i already have it downloaded here which is io underscore gh tools so downloads uh where is it where is it io gh tools there it is so we're gonna click that double click it and it should be installed now we're gonna look for it gh tools and we're gonna enable import export gh tools guitar hero toolkit there we go. So that's how you install GH Tools. And now, let's get to the funny business. Let's make a highway for Guitar Hero World Tour Definitive Edition. The first thing you're going to do in Blender is to click, is to press N. And then we're going to open this GH Tools tab. We're going to set up a highway scene. And now we're, we're gonna, you're going to press 0 on your numpad so we get the camera scene. And uh, press Z, Material Preview, so we get, a, so we get the preview of what the highway is going to look like. Select the highway, it's now highlighted. Go to UV editing, go to image, replace, and locate the highway you want to use. Of course I have my Clone Hero Highways folder in here. And we're gonna install this cool looking lightning bolt highway called Neon Salama. And while we're still in UV editing, this is one thing Derpytron forgot to mention in his tutorial. We're gonna change the My Highway image name here. If we leave it as such, the highway will still work, but in single player only. Because if you have a more custom highways that all share the same texture name, My Highway image, they're not going to work in multiplayer. So we're gonna change this to, you can call it whatever you want. I'm gonna call it Neon Salama HW, which stands for highway. All right. So back to layout, this is what it looks like, and now we're going to export the pack file. Export highway pack, locate your mods folder in Guitar Hero World Tour, wherever you have it installed. I have a highways folder for it, and now we're going to create this highway. So we're going to create a new folder, we're going to call it Neon Salama Highway. And then you're going to add a content folder. And then call your pack file, whatever you want. I'm gonna call it Neon Salama underscore HW, which stands for highway, dot pack dot XCN. And then you'll export highway pack. So the highway is now finished. Now we're going to do the thumbnail, which will show up in, uh, in uh, uh, Creator Rocker. And this is very simple to do. All you're gonna do is render, render image, image, save as, and then uh, you're, you're gonna save it to wherever you have your guitar or SDK installed. You're gonna save it to assets, IMG, and uh, call it whatever you want. I call it Neon Salama HWTN. I'm gonna do it that underscore, for, yeah. So we're gonna call it that, save as image. So we're done with the Blender portion of the video. Now we are, so here we have the, the thing uh, rendered right here, the one we just uh, exported. So now we're going to go to Guitar SDK, launch Guitar Hero SDK. Yeah, uh, you're gonna go to Assets, Images, to IMG Raw, and select the highway you just uh, saved the thumbnail as. Press Enter, press it again, 
and now we're gonna exit the game. I mean, exit the guitar SDK. So we're gonna go back to assets, go to IMG, process, and locate the highway thumbnail you just saved. It, we have it right here. So we're gonna we're gonna copy it or Control C it. Then you're gonna go back to your highways uh, folder, where we, wherever you saved your original highway. Go to your highway content folder and paste it. And the last thing we're going to do is that we're gonna add a highway.ini file. I have a template right here, so we're gonna copy this. We're gonna paste it right here and call it highway.ini. And here's what you're gonna add. You're gonna add mod info. You're gonna add the name of the highway, which I'll go, which I'll call Neon Salama Highway. Have the description as highway. You can put your name as the author and version as 1.0. And for the highway info, for the name, this is the name you'll see in Creator Rocker when selecting this highway. So we're gonna call it Neon Salama. And then the pack name is uh, going to be the the highway itself, which is this one, the pack.xen. We're just gonna copy the name right here, Control C and Control V. You don't have you don't have to put the uh, you don't have to put the dot pack.xen. And for the preview image, we're gonna do the same. We're gonna take this uh, HWTN. TN stands for thumbnail and paste it. And for the texture, we're gonna go back to Blender, and the texture name is going to be whatever you named in my high my highway image, which I'll which I named Neon Salama. This is very important because uh, you know if you want your custom highways to work in multiplayer correctly. So now we're going to save this, and now we have the highway created for Guitar World to Definitive Edition, and we're gonna check what it looks like. Alright, so let's check what the highway looks like. Go to career. Let's create a random rocker. And let's see where the highway is. It should be at the very bottom. And there it is. So we're gonna enable this. And we're ready to rock. So let's play. So let's test it. So let's test this out. We're gonna choose a random song. Arterial black, white and box. Why the hell not? There's a rocker we just created. And there's our highway. Looking pretty slick. So I hope you enjoyed the tutorial and I hope you will get to get creative and all with all the highways you'll create and we'll see ya.